Do you want to know one of the easiest ways you can be a profitable sports better? No, you don't have to be incredibly smart when it comes to sports. You don't have to have a model or a system that tells you what to bet. You don't need anything like that. All you need to do is a little thing called line shopping. It's really easy. It's the easiest way to be a profitable sports better. It's just the number one thing everybody should do. And like I said, it's called line shopping. So this video will be a quick tutorial on what line shopping means, how to line shop, and why it's profitable. So let's get into it. What's up, everybody? My name is Matt Modai. I'm a content producer and betting analyst for OddsJam. And as I mentioned in the intro, this video is going to be giving you a quick guide on what line shopping means when it comes to sports betting. So the literal definition of what line shopping is when it comes to sports betting is you are just looking out for the best odds or the best lines when betting on a game. So for example, let's say you want to bet on my Sixers here to my right or your left. In that situation, if you want to bet on the Sixers, what you would do is you would look at every sports book that is available in your state and you would find where you can get them at the best odds. So for example, let's say I'm looking at DraftKings, a sports book that we really like, and the Sixers are three and a half point favorites. Not bad, whatever, depending on the matchup, all that stuff. But let's say I also look at another sports book and I look at BetMGM and they are only two and a half point favorites. I'm getting that point difference just from looking at the different sports books. So it might not seem like a big deal, but an easy way to be a profitable sports better is just to just to stack as many times as you can where you're betting on the best odds. So A, that's why it's so important to be signed up everywhere you can. So definitely make sure that if sports betting is legal in your state, that you look at the links in the description and you sign up using those links. There's also bonuses you can take advantage of if you use those links. But for the purpose of this video, the more sports books you're signed up for, the best chance you have of getting the best odds so you are more and more successful line shopper when you are betting on sports. So I figure the best way to show you what it looks like to line shop when you're looking at a point spread is just to provide you an example. So in this example, we got a pretty good college basketball game, Villanova versus Connecticut. So I have bet MGM up here and it looks like Villanova's two and a half point underdogs, Connecticut is two and a half point favorites. So Right off the bat, I see two and a half on bet MGM each way between Villanova and Connecticut, right? Minus 110 odds both ways. Let's look at one other sports book, Caesars, the one I have up here, and see what the odds are there. So already, we are finding value if we wanted to bet on Connecticut. Um, we see here, they are only minus two at minus one, the same exact odds. So instead of getting Connecticut at minus two and a half on bet MGM, you can get them at minus two on Caesar Sportsbook. So that's just an example of getting better odds solely from line shopping. So Connecticut, in this case, if they only win by two, you wouldn't lose your money if you bet on Caesars, but you would if you bet on BetMGM. Let's look at another one. Let's see what DraftKings has to offer. So in this case, Villanova and UConn are still two and a half. The spread is still, is still two and a half. But in this case, if you wanted to bet on Villanova, you would get those odds at minus 120 as opposed to minus 110 on bet MGM. So again, let's you're, if you're betting on Villanova plus two and a half and you're betting it on bet MGM, you are already gonna make more profit if that bet wins solely from looking at the different sports books. And I've only looked at three, there's more available to me, so I could be getting even better odds, but I just wanted to provide an example of what it looks like to line shop and why it's so valuable. Line shopping doesn't have to be with a spread. It could also be when you're betting on a money line. So for example, for that Sixers one, let's say DraftKings has them at three and a half point favorites and they're minus 200 money line, where bet MGM, they were two and a half point favorites. And let's say they're only minus 170 money line. Um, situations like that is still a, when you are successful line shopping because you are betting on the same exact outcome just the Sixers winning the game. But if you do that on BetMGM for this example, you are getting that at better odds. So again, you stack more and more of those bets together and eventually you're just gonna make more money betting on sports solely from line shopping without doing any other analysis. And here's an example of what I'm talking about. So I have three different sports books up. I have BetMGM, Caesars, and, and uh, DraftKings. So let's say there's a great college basketball game tonight, Michigan State versus Iowa. Let's say, you know what? I actually like Michigan State as the underdog here. I think they're going to win. I could bet them at plus 220 on bet MGM. Let's see what Caesars has. Oh, that's plus 230. That's already a better line than I got just from looking one sportsbook over. 
Now let's look at DraftKings, plus 220. So the same thing as BetMGM. So because I looked at only three sports books, I didn't even look at every sports book that is available to me. I already found an example of a sports book with better odds. In this case, it is Caesars. So there's never going to be one sports book that always has the best odds. They're always going to be different. So that's why it's so important to make sure that you check every single one and also that you are signed up with every single one because, again, it just gives you the best chance of finding a positive expected value bet. Okay, so now that we understand what line shopping is and why it's so valuable, I'm going to show you the easiest way to line shop every sports book that's available to you because you're going to sign up for them. It's just using Odds Jam, right? So what I did, I'm just on the odds page, odds basketball. I clicked into this Iowa versus Michigan State game. And instead of having to go to every sports book individually, Odds Jam puts them all on this page for me. So now I want to bet Michigan State. I know exactly what every sports book has. And I know exactly what the best odds are because it's highlighted in yellow for me. So looks like plus 225, the best odds I'm going to get on Michigan State. Minus 250 are the best odds I'm going to get on Iowa. They also have it for the point spread. So same thing here. They they highlight where the main line is for sports books, and they highlight what each sports book has. So I could get Iowa at minus five and a half on BetMGM and on Caesars at minus one ten odds. Or if I'm not line shopping, I would bet a full point higher <clears throat> at the same exact odds. So at, they're at minus six and a half at minus 110 odds on BallyBet and DraftKings. So a really easy way to line shop is just access this free page on oddsjam.com. It's incredibly easy. It lists everything for you. And it lists what the best odds are in yellow, what the main line is highlighted in black here. It's an incredibly easy tool to use to line shop. And like I said at the beginning, it's the easiest way to profit while betting on sports. It's just to bet the best lines. And that's all I got for you. So hope you enjoyed the video. Again, my name is Matt Modai. I'm a content producer and betting analyst for Odds Jam. Uh, if you did like the video, I would appreciate a like, a comment on the video itself. If you hated it, you can also comment and let me know what I got wrong. Um, other than that, I would appreciate just to share to you with share the video with your friends, subscribe to the Odds Jam YouTube channel, all that good stuff. Just help us grow, help us help as many people cash. But so that's all I got for you. So thanks for watching and have a good one.